Hello everyone, my name is Dylan and I'm your host. Welcome to the cave. We talk about everything cartoon, TV show, and movie related. And today we're going to be talking about Disney, like Disney in general. Um, so yeah, let's get right into the video. Disney was created on October 16th, 1923. Turning Red was released on February 21st, 2022. We're not mainly going to be talking about Turning Red, but we're going to be, I mean, it's going to be a part of this video, but I decided to give Turning Red a little shot last night, decided to watch it. That is the most awkward and weirdest movie Disney has ever released. That was such a weird movie. I mean, it was basically about a horny 13 year old girl. It was really freaking weird and she just turns into a panda bear and she's drooling over boy it it was very awkward so i had to stop watching it probably after like the first like half an hour i i couldn't watch anymore so that was definitely a fail in my book and that just goes along with disney really cannot make any good movies unless it's like a sequel and even their sequels are really really bad Disney has like lost her touch over the years. They definitely have. Um, you know, I think it was maybe around like probably like 2010 where they really lost their touch with making movies because the movies they make now are really not that good. Um, I don't know if you guys think differently, but in my opinion, I really don't think Disney has created a really good movie in the last like five to six years. See, the thing is like, they keep on looking to the past. They keep on making as many sequels as they can instead of coming up with a new original movie. The TV shows are definitely nothing special of what they made. I think the last good TV show that they had was Gravity Falls. From what I heard, I've already made a video on this that I've really I've, I've watched like maybe like a few minutes of Gravity Falls. I definitely need to check it out. I feel really bad for not watching it because I already know it's going to be a good show, but they keep on looking to the past they keep on wanting to make sequels because they can't come up with a good idea on what to do as an original movie they're technically just the type of company that are just chasing the money and that that's all they're trying to do they're trying to get as much money as they possibly can and you know they want to keep on once again bringing sequels out they keep on bringing sequels out just to get you know some butts and chairs you know at the movie theater that way they can make their money and then, you know, if, you know, a bunch of people say the movie's terrible, they don't really care because they already made their money. There's only a handful of movies that have been good in the last decade that like aren't sequels to another movie. It feels like Disney really cannot create their own original movie anymore. You know, in the early 2000s and 90s, even before that, they were making original movies. They had the original movies. They had, you know they're making all these great titles they're making you know aladdin lion king lilo and stitch uh they're a little mermaid you know all the disney princesses even some of those were actually pretty decent but it seems like these days they either make sequels about a movie and make it like realistic or they sit here and you know make a movie that's like a little eh, like turning red that was not the best movie in the world um, it was once again, very awkward, especially since I'm 20 years old and watching a movie about a 13 year old girl who is like kind of going after boys and she turns into a red panda bear. And it's just, it, it's just a weird and awkward kind of movie. I don't understand why they would make that movie for kids because it, it's not really a movie for kids, especially with the stuff that they talk about is very very awkward for adults like myself i i don't understand why they make movies like that once again that's just my opinion but let me know in the comments below like what you guys think do you guys think that disney is you know really dropping the ball on making good movies and tv shows especially tv shows they really don't make any good cartoons or you know tv shows anymore there really has not been you know a good one even if it's like a real you know human tv show like going back in time like you know we have tv shows like uh austin and ally zach and cody hannah montana that's so raven Corey in the house i mean we have all these great tv shows on disney that we used to have and now i don't even know like 
what they really have i watched a couple of them like for a little bit and they're nothing compared to like the original tv shows now i'm not saying you know do a remake of you know zach and cody or something like come up with something really original that's going to be good and it seems like they really don't know how to do that anymore and you know they really have lost their touch and that's why i kind of get disappointed every single time that disney drops the movie um once again that's my opinion you guys of course can have your own opinion but i feel like disney is not the same of what it used to be and of course it's not going to be the same but i'm hoping that in the future they can you know raise up their standards just a little bit because it seems like they just want to rush a movie just to hurry up and make it but anyway guys i hope you guys enjoyed please leave me a huge favor hit that like button and subscribe if you have not already i really would appreciate it and i'll see you guys in the next one all right guys later does it hurt when i touch it that's okay no no touching you have fallen you think